are not separable. They are inseparable. They are lockstep. And that is what is created. Man, this atmosphere. and Again, listen. We delineate. There to my family. There, and there are those who have stormed the United States Capitol. Those who have stormed and have taken this to a violent end must be dealt with. And as Leader McCarthy made clear, they are violating the law and must be prosecuted. We sit here just before 4 o'clock on the East Coast, and it appears all the violence is over. It appears most, if not all, lawmakers are in and around the Capitol campus whether it's in the Capitol building itself or the House and Senate office buildings or the visitor center, which is actually there just below where most of these... So y'all praise the white folks, man. That's our problem. ...classified briefings and, frankly, uh, shelters designed for security incidents like this. Line target. One got a $10, two got for $15. Yeah. Five got $30. They need to save money, keep the calls clean. Check out this place. People locked out the system. They need to save money, keep the calls clean. How y'all doing? Save money, keep the calls clean. Lodge charge you one gallon for ten dollars, two gallon for fifteen dollars. Tied or gang. Lodge charge. Save money, keep your calls clean. Just show them situation. This is what yeah. one gallon gain, ten dollars, two gallon for fifteen dollars. Help my people save money, keep their clothes clean. Plus, we got to learn to shop, support black businesses. See how much them white folks hate us. Save money, keep your clothes clean. Lodge told you one gallon for ten dollars, two gallon for fifteen dollars. Don this washing liquid gallon for ten dollars. Doing save money, keep your clothes clean. Lodge told you one gallon for ten dollars, two gallon for fifteen dollars. I'm quite sure we all could use save some money sometime. Thank you. That's what I, you know. This. Showing our bad shopping habits as people. How we work against ourselves, work against us as people. Lodge charge you one gallon for ten dollars, two gallon for fifteen dollars. How you doing? How you doing? Take care. What type of line charge you use? I use um, tire. I sell tire. I, still, I do that too. Size simple. I'm out of tie simple, but I got the regular gang of tie right now. 
skin yeah, kind of dries. Okay, I do that too. That's the clear kind. Oh, yeah, so that's how it's simple. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, do, I don't use any uh, fabric sample. Right, you got, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Certain people can, yeah. That's the, I use, I sell a tie simple, and then I do the uh, Dove body wash cream. Got them for $10 for. I have to do all of Oh, I do all of Olay, but I'm out of all of Olay. I got all of Olay Blossom. Because I would love to. All right. I can't. I, I, it just won't mess my skin. Okay, all right. I appreciate you. you. Thank you. One got a line detergent, ten dollars. Two got for fifteen dollars. Gain on tire line detergent. Also got Dawn dishwashing liquid. So when I when I, I'm really gonna show in this documentary, you know, just how we do, how we act towards each other as a people, you know, and when we talk about economics and the difference and what real black business is, you got to understand our behavior as people, you know. See, most of these people, they, 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 if you cashing your check here, you cannot afford not to look for ways to save money. Laundry detergent. One got in the laundry detergent ten dollars. Two got in the laundry detergent fifteen. What type of laundry detergent you use, my brother? You don't wash your clothes. What kind of laundry detergent you use? You see, this is what I be talking about. How black people hate to shop with black people. What type of laundry detergent you use? I got. I sell that type of laundry detergent. Yeah. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I talk about black people like that because that's what I'm, I'm. That's what I'm doing because I'm building the business. You don't want to disclose that. Right, right. I understand that, my brother. But I'm talking, bro. I can keep talking, bro. Listen, I can keep talking, my brother. But but I can keep talking. I can keep talking. Fuck wrong with you? This is what I mean about ignorant ass old ass house niggas. I'm discussing. I stop at house niggas. Shut up. I'm talking. House nigga, I'm talking. God damn. Trying to talk to black people about saving money and shopping and supporting black businesses. This house nigga is angry about that type of conversation. So, yeah, because I, I'm, I'm doing the podcast. I'm, I discuss economics and our position. Because uh, you poor, you in here to check cash and place like the rest of us. I'm offering people opportunity to save money and you talking crazy to me for no fucking reason. That's the fuck wrong with black people now. That's why we in our predicament. We don't know how to support each other. You go to the store, you buy Tide or Gang, I buy your white labeling and resell it. You could learn something at the same fucking time, but you, but you niggas so much hateful towards your own people that I can't even often sell you something cheaper than the white folks or the Arabs or the Asians sell you. I filmed this so I could put it up on Facebook because I constantly show the ignorance of my fucking people. You go to the store, you pay $18 for one guy in the tide. I say you, I say you two guys for $15. I do money back guarantee. You try to product, you don't like it, you buy it back. I'm staying right here next door. What's the problem with learning how to support your own fucking people? Well, listen to your people when you see your people trying to make an honest living. It's ignorant as fuck. Just ignorant as fuck. That's why we in a position where we in the bottom of the fucking barrel. Say something. you the fucking check cash the place and they charging you to spend your own fucking money. Because they locked you out the banking system. Ignorant ass niggas can't learn shit. If I ignorant ass niggas ain't got shit. Poor ass niggas ain't gonna never have shit unless we learn to support and build business in ourselves. Stupid ass niggas. Black businesses hire black people. Yo old ass stupid, you don't know that. That's why you stood out of check casting place at 50 some fucking years old. That's why your old ass surviving on Social Security. I'm finna leave, but I'ma say what the fuck I wanna say. Y'all know how I am. Say what the fuck I wanna say. Cause he ain't had no business getting in my fucking conversation. House nigga ass.